Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, Today we're going to be revisiting another great property in the town of Montecilfone. This property, I also do not understand why it hasn't sold. It has a beautiful view out into the mountains, possibly to the ocean a little bit, the I think. Sea. Yeah, yeah, to the, I think yeah, so. to the ocean, to the sea, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> to the water. <laughs> and um, it's got uh, good size rooms, um, it's ready to go, it just needs a little bit bit of tender loving care. A gorgeous cantina. Yeah, gorgeous cantina that um, can be reconfigured and look spectacular. So a couple of balconies. So guys really have a little have another look at this one if you haven't had a look at it already. Let us know what you think in the comment section. See you in the next one. Ciao. Ciao. As I mentioned before, this home is in our beloved town of Montecilfone in Molise. The population here is about 1400 people and the altitude is 405 meters above sea level. We are located only 15 minutes from the beautiful beaches of the Adriatic Sea. The biggest closest city is Termoli, only 20 minutes away which has a population of over 33,000 people. So if there is anything you can't get in Montecilfone, Termoli is just a comfortable drive away. We have a couple of videos on Termoli, so be sure to check out the description section of this video. In Montecilfone you can find a couple of mini markets, butchers, bars, bakery, doctors, dentist and a hardware store plus much more. Be sure to watch the whole video for more details. We love the weather in Montecilfone as the seasons are nicely defined. Summers are dry and not humid, which we really love. And winters are quite mild. Yes, it does get coldish but it only snows once or twice during a given winter. The people in Montecilfone are friendly and here we have been able to feel at home very quickly. When it comes down to languages, they speak the local dialect, which is Arboresh, also Italian. Quite a few of them can speak German and a handful can speak Spanish and some English. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be looking at a home in our beautiful town of Montecilfone in Molise. The home has three bedrooms, one and a half bathrooms, is moving ready and it has great access. We hope that you enjoyed this video. Okay guys, so this one here is the house that we're going to be looking at. Hello! Shortly we're going to be looking at what is inside that door and then another door over here. I expect that we're going to see things like the boiler and storage space for wood and things like that. So as we enter we find a set of very comfortable stairs and they have a little table here with chairs and of course your quintessential herb pots. We just came from there of course and then as we enter on this floor we're going to find the kitchen and dining a half bathroom and then one bedroom that way over here we have the stairs to go to the first floor and then we'll find two bedrooms and a full bathroom there And 
and here let's take a look storage ah great buckets and things like that nice size sink and mirror and then we just came from there We are actually right across from a home, that home, which we showed recently and the view here is amazing. The afternoon sun will kind of come over that way. And at the moment it's about 2 p.m. and the sun is right there. We are only a couple of minutes walk from one of the supermarkets and the water the water what? the water refilling station which we keep talking about because you can get oh, um, you can get gasata sparkling water <laughs> okay we have a stove gas stove Bedroom number
The stairs are pretty comfortable and they take us to the first floor of the house and here we find one full bathroom, pretty nice size, toilet, bidet and shower. You may want to update later on the tiles or if you're into pink, this will be perfect for you. The vanity is nice size and then we have high ceilings throughout the house. You know how much I love high ceilings. And here we have a window which you can open fully with shutters as well. And this window faces the front of the house. Honey! Ciao! And then we have the sea over there. Here we find bedroom number two, great size as well. There's definitely a lot more light in this area of the house. Still high ceilings, you can see the height and the size of this cupboard. So by that you'll be able to tell how large it, it is. We have a balcony here with double doors and you have this gorgeous view. So this is what you will wake up to. And the height is great. It's really, you feel the difference between looking at the horizon there from this level of the house to the level below. Because here we are pretty much above all the houses around. Over that way we have the bars of the town and another supermarket and other services. Let's go and check out our third bedroom.
again pretty large size bedroom they even have a, I think it's probably a queen size bed here and then a single bed right there and this one also has the balcony which connects to the balcony of the bedroom we just saw and nothing is obstructing the view as a side note there is a house there being renovated that's why you have the scaffold in there there's a lot of renovations going on in the town which is always a great thing to be part of the roof is in good condition you have the gas available but it just needs to be connected the owners of this home have been using it as a holiday home they live in a different region so pretty much they just come in the summer and haven't had the need to have the gas connected so they just use a gas bottle we just went there our bedroom number two this is our full bathroom let's go back downstairs If you enjoy our content, please consider supporting us on Patreon, I will leave the link on the description. On this side of the house, we have a cantina there, which I can't wait to show you because it's beautiful. That's one of the reasons I, I love cantinas so much. Um, they usually leave them intact, so they preserve all that character that garage doesn't belong to the house it has been sold the same as this one so what we have is the cantina kitchen and dining right here our first bedroom our second bedroom and our third bedroom let's check this cantina out there is actually a forno so there is an oven there where the owner has been making pizza and this is what i mean look at those vaulted ceilings like this star shape or half a star because on this side we don't have it but look at that oh my god i think i haven't seen that shape here in Monte Chilfone actually until now. We'll put the measurements of the cantina on the screen in a second. What would you do with this space? Would you use it as a workshop where you try to do a second kitchen here as more Italians would? Let us know in the comments. Okay, someone likes their wine. Look at this, wow, I love it. Pizza oven right here.
e quelle porte eh, quella porta è della caldaia mo ti prendo la chiave ok e ma que e quella verde anche sì, sì pure quella verde, verde sua. sì ok ok as we told you before yes this is a part that belongs to the house and they have the water reserve here so in these hilltop towns it is very common that houses have that big pump there because back in the day sometimes the water wouldn't come all the way up and then people will have the reserve there as a backup i can hear actually this working at the moment the boiler does that How big is this space? Maybe three, four square meters. Okay, so we're back here. Ah, Aiden managed to open the door. Ah, okay. Yeah, that's exactly what I imagined. The stairs are up there and the area where the table and chair is just there. Okay, that's it. That was all the excitement. Thank you so much for watching this video we hope that you enjoyed it as always please let us know your thoughts in the comment section Thank you so much to our patrons for their generosity, your extra support is really appreciated. If you would like to enjoy more of our personal and everyday content, be sure to check out my personal channel. We have a lot more content for you to enjoy. If you would like to continue watching other home tours, please click here. If you would like to watch the videos of our own purchase and renovation story, click here. Please remember to like, comment and subscribe and we'll see you next time. Ciao!